Okay, mi gente, welcome back to Purely Walking. Your girl Ellie here, and today we're gonna be doing a drive through of a very peculiar avenue, in my opinion, here in Santo Domingo, and that is Charles Sumner Avenue. So, if you wanna know why exactly I say that this avenue is quite peculiar, then just keep on watching. So this avenue is right in the middle of the city. It runs east to west and vice versa, beginning on Churchill Avenue and ending in Eliseo Grullón Street, all the way down in Los Prados, which is a very popular sector here in Santo Domingo. The newest addition to this avenue is Metro Plaza, which is going to be right here to our right. It is a very modern plaza. It has a supermarket, it has some dining options, and it has an Alice store, which is like a home department store type of thing. Right after Metro Plaza, you have to your left a Price Mart store. If you remember, there is another Price Mart store in Avenida Bolivar. If you want to go check out that video, there's another Price Mart store there. Well, here is the one in Charles Sumner Avenue. And if you didn't know, Price Mart is basically a store where you can buy things in bulk. You need a membership to enter. And it would be your equivalent to like Sam's Club or Costco in the United States. So as you can probably tell, there are a lot of different things in this avenue. So you have like the modern uh, plazas, the businesses, the stores, the dining options. But you also have these buildings, like the ones to our right, that are like actual apartment buildings where people live. And the reason why I say this avenue is quite peculiar is because there is a stark difference that you can see as you drive on in the avenue. So before we just left behind like the modern part, now you can kind of see that the businesses start getting a little different in terms of the style. It starts getting a little bit more informal, more looking like a barrio type of thing. And that is because there is a barrio eh, right beside or behind, should I say, these businesses called Los Praditos. So there is a barrio here. Um, I didn't go into it because I just wanted to show you what the avenue has, but you can see the stark difference of these uh, types of businesses with regards to the ones that we saw before. Now you're gonna see another change that the street makes. So we're getting out of like the barrio area and as soon as we um, pass this Texaco uh, gas station, 
the businesses start getting a little, you know, preppier and a little bit more modern once more. Here to our right, you're going to see a strip of auto detail type of stores, one beside the other. white building to the right is called Centro Medico Moderno. It is a private clinic. It is one of the most important medical centers in Santo Domingo and certainly in this part of town. So as soon as you pass Centro Medico Moderno, you turn up into this uh, intersection and the street begins to get a lot less frequented, a lot less busy. And that is certainly because there are less uh, businesses in this part of the avenue. So like I said, the next intersection actually ends our route for today. So I guess this would be a good time for me to just sign out. Hope you guys have a good one. I do also hope that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. We are trying to get to 3,000 subscribers, which I believe will be there very soon. I just wanted to say I appreciate everyone who has already subscribed so much. So this is me signing out. I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.